There is no other mitzvah like the mitzvah of tzedakah. Because when I put on tefillin, I'm using my arm and my head. When I study Torah, I'm using my mouth and my brains. When I give tzedakah, the human being spends most of his life in blood and sweat and tears making a buck. We work and we work and we invest our kishkas eight hours a day, 10 hours a day, 24 hours a day. A deal pending, a deal missing, like Jackie Mason says. We're coming, we're going. Your whole life is dedicated to making money. And then you're going to take the money you made and gave it away? Give it away? You're insane. That's what the evil inclination says when it tells us not to give charity. When we give charity, we take our blood, sweat, and tears, which we invested everything into, and give it to Hashem. There's no greater elevation of material physicality than the mitzvah of tzedakah, because it is giving our all away. That's why the mitzvah of charity brings with it such tremendous blessings, because it's so irrational, it's so illogical. Why should I give my money away? Our, our sages, in fact, say that if a person finds that they're struggling economically, they should go back and make sure they're giving at least 10% of their income, if not 20, to tzedakah, and our sages guarantee that everything will change and there'll be more money. Is that logical? I don't think your accountant will agree. Is that rational? No. Is it Torah? Yes. That's the gift of God.